This is a EE 4G mini Wi-Fi router. It comes with the router, a pouch to keep it in, a SIM insertion tool, a USB 2 Type-C cable, a SIM card, the SIM card will be for whichever package you go for. The Keep Me card has got the Wi-Fi password on the back. It's got terms and conditions, a quick start guide and obviously a little bit of bump there about how to dispose of the unit. All of this stuff fits easily into the pouch, so it's quite portable. It would be fairly bulky to fit in your pocket, but it is small enough to fit in your pocket so you could carry it around in your pocket if you wanted to. It's got a 1500 milliamp hour battery which means it can go on standby for about 50 hours and you can use it for about 6 hours constantly which is not bad. The unit accepts a nano sim which goes into this little slot there and as you can see it's recessed in there so you do kind of need the tool to insert the sim. You can do it with a long fingernail but I think you'd struggle. This is a power button. You need to hold it down for a few seconds to turn it on and then those four little green quadrants there tell you the charge in the battery so it's got a full charge at the moment. It's got a USB output and a type C input. The Type-C input is for charging and then this USB output is to allow you to charge phones and other devices because you can use it as a battery pack but only down to 25%. Once the battery gets to 25% then you can't use it as a power bank. The unit will tell you whether it's got a 4G or a 3G signal. It will tell you whether you've got an email waiting and it will also tell you the strength of the signal. There's five LEDs and at the moment we've got three dots so it's not too bad a signal. He described this as a mini Wi-Fi hotspot in your pocket and that's exactly what it's like. You put one of these in your pocket and as long as it's receiving a signal then you have got a Wi-Fi connection wherever you go. Now I bought it because we've got a canal boat and where we moor it the Wi-Fi signal is next to useless so I bought this so that my wife, my daughter and myself can access the internet on the boat when we're out and about and for that it is very very good. It is very fast and I'll try and demonstrate just how fast it is now. The other thing is it can support up to 10 devices so you can connect 10 devices to this one box all at once so it's very very versatile. I've connected my iPad to the EE router let's just do a speed test on it So 57.8 megabits per second download and 30.34 megabits per second upload is phenomenal compared to what I get at home. I'm on a BT line and we're about a mile and a quarter away from the box and I'll show you what we get with BT. So that there is with EE. I'll swap over to BT now. So this is BT. So there is a world of difference between my home broadband connection, which is this one, and the one before which was the EE router. And the EE connection is infinitely better than the BT one. You can use a router while it's charging, so if you've got a power pack or a car adapter or anything like that, you can actually be charging the thing up as you're going along so you're not wasting the battery. And if you're going in the middle of nowhere, take a power pack with you, and the bigger the better, then that would keep you going for a fair amount of time. So you could be checking your emails, watching Facebook, whatever you wanted to do in the middle of nowhere, really. At the moment, EE have got the best coverage in the UK, so you stand more chance of connecting with their equipment than you do with anybody else's. EE 4G mini Wi-Fi mobile broadband router. Now, I've had this thing a couple of months now I did a lot of research before I bought it EE have got the best coverage in the UK for 4G networks it's a very capable piece of kit it's way faster than my home broadband which is BT it's very easy to operate it's got a reasonably large battery so you could use it as a power bank small and compact fits in your pocket easy to operate so think about the size of SIM card that you're going to get and what deal you're going for so I think if you're thinking of buying something like a mobile broadband router you will not go wrong with this one I'm very happy with it think about the usage and I will say that you need to be really careful what you're doing when you're using it because if you've got all your equipment set to automatically download and you turn your phone on and it downloads an update or something like that right you can easily mop up your allowance without realizing it so be very very careful how you set your equipment up but it will give you broadband access virtually anywhere in the country. So yes, I recommend this. I'm really glad I bought it. It's a good piece of kit. I hope you found the review useful and thank you for watching.